It happens to the best of us. Maybe there was a power outage, maybe daylight saving snuck up on you, or perhaps you just inherited a system with a wonky clock. Whatever the reason, an inaccurate time on your EPOS Now system can wreak havoc on your sales reports, staff scheduling, and overall customer experience. But fear not, fellow retail warriors. Today's video is your one-stop shop for conquering EPOS Now's time settings. We'll be diving deep into both automatic and manual adjustments, so you can ensure your system is always running on clock time. Now, before we jump in, a quick heads up. The specific steps might vary slightly depending on the type of EPOS Now hardware you're using, but the overall process should be pretty consistent. So, with that out of the way, let's get started. Facing the automatic time monster. Imagine this. You wake up one crisp morning, ready to tackle the day, only to realize your phone clock is mysteriously off. Annoyance? Absolutely. But in the retail world, an incorrect automatic time setting can be a real headache. The good news is, Epos Now offers an automatic time function that syncs with the internet to keep your system's clock in check. To see if it's enabled, follow these steps. Log in to your Epos Now back office. This is the web-based portal where you manage your entire system. Navigate to the Settings section. It's usually tucked away under a gear icon or something similar. Look for a menu option labeled General or System Settings. This is where the timekeeping magic happens. Find the setting for Automatic Date and Time. It might be a simple on-off toggle or a drop-down menu with options like Enabled and Disabled. Taming the Manual Time Beast. Now, what if you're like me and trust issues prevent you from relying solely on the internet? No worries. Epos Now also allows manual time adjustments. Here's how to take control. Following those same steps from before, reach the General or System Settings menu in your back office. If automatic date and time was enabled, disable it. We don't want any automatic shenanigans interfering with our manual masterpiece. Look for a section labeled Date and time. This is where you get to play clockmaker. You should see options to adjust the year, month, day, hour, minute, and maybe even seconds. Use the arrows or keypad to set the correct time. Don't forget the time zone. Select the appropriate zone from the drop down menu to ensure your system reflects the local time. Double checking your handiwork. Once you've set the time, it's always a good idea to double check your work. Here's how. Head back to your EPOS Now terminal the physical device you use to ring up customers. Look for a clock display on the terminal screen. It's usually located somewhere on the main screen. Compare the time on the terminal with the time you just set in the back office. If they match, you're golden. High fives all around. Bonus tip, the power of consistency. If you have multiple Epos Now terminals, it's crucial to ensure all of them display the same time. Here's a quick tip. After setting the time in the back office, Log in to each individual terminal. Do a quick visual confirmation that the time matches. This might seem like a no-brainer, but trust me, consistency is key when it comes to accurate sales reports and happy customers. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.